Howdy folks, welcome back to SnowRunner. We are on the village custom scenario. I just brought this Kraz out of the garage from getting fixed up. By the time I got that lumber on the trailer, half the suspension was gone. So, we can stick with this one for a little while, but I have other things going on. All part of the bigger picture. <clears throat> we need to get these two lumber over here to the quarry. But I've got a vehicle, I've got a scout vehicle up here waiting to grab meat for the workers. Because it's part of the hungry workers job. And I spotted a scout vehicle up there ahead of time because that's a long ass drive. And I've got another truck sitting over here with material on it. And I've got a scout sitting there with one consumable. And it all has to end up up there. So you see, I got a lot of running to do without that extra trip. So we're in the Kraz. We might as well stay in the Kraz and just move. <clears throat> this map has updated. It's been a long time since I've recorded anything on the village. I had quite a few That's new, which brings me to my topic. I had quite a view, quite a few village videos already on my computer. And the reason I'm recording this one is because I ran out. I needed a new one. Well, in, in the meantime, the map updated. There is a lot of stuff different. There's a lot more jobs than there were. <clears throat> like this job right here, Hungry Workers. I already did this job in a previous video. And what I did is I combined it with that I'm doing the same thing I'm going to do today. I combined it with, see like this never used to be underwater. It was along the water's edge, but as close as you got. Um, Give me a sec. Oh, that's where you go back in the corner and you open the fuel station. Yeah, but I'm damn I'm I'm damn near here to the quarry. I do need to go back there, but I don't need to waste the time right now. Because I need to go this way. But I think at this point I'm going to go ahead and do the. I'm going to grab the meat as it is. 
<clears throat> so I'll talk more as we go along, but like I say, I've done this. What the point was, was to bring the wood in and take the concrete for the next job out. And I already had it up there. But because the map updated, I have to do it over. Now this is a new mod that's already all busted up from getting over here, but this is the new Jeep IX-5 mod. When I, saw, when I saw this, I couldn't hardly wait to get my hands on it. And I've had it a couple of weeks, and uh, this is the first opportunity I've had to bring it out. It was so expensive, you know, to... I couldn't buy it on... Um, one of the other maps where I'm only at level 2 or level 5 or whatever I needed. I needed some serious money for this thing. And this isn't meant to be a mod review or anything. Um, a few minutes of inching up the road. But uh, I just wanted to let you guys see what I would have grabbed this off camera and then not even told you about it. <laughs> but I wanted you guys to see what I was finishing this stage with. I knew it would say stage completed. So I just wanted to get that far. But I'm not going to stay here where the music is playing because no matter where else I go that music is going to continue to play so I'm going to get out away from that okay no music here I'll just shut the engine off, set the brake, and leave it there. Oh, that's something it does now. <laughs> does that on Scouts or DLCs, I guess. So I got the meat. Now I need to bring the wood to the hungry workers so that they can have their bonfire and eat. And as always with the as always with the um Yeah, that'll work with the uh, with the with the quarry. It's always a question about how to get in, how to get out. I think I will. Where am I? I'm right here. I think I will cut cross country right here. Go up to that, and then go down and around and in here. And the wood has to go over here. Maybe I can drive across. It's probably all rocky and shit, but maybe I can drive across. Come back up that way and right out. Or do some U-turning. I 
I haven't been in and out of the quarry, obviously, since they redesigned it. It's the first trip since they redesigned the quarry. Or they redesigned the map. I shouldn't say they redesigned the quarry. Yeah, it kind of sucks. I, I came on here to to get you guys a new village video because you haven't had one in a long time. And then I end up having to do work over again that I've already completed. Only, actually, only half this job. What you're watching now is the part that I've already done in the past. The other part, once I jump into the IX3880, um, that is new stuff. This is where I was thinking maybe we can go across. You know what? I'm not sure I want to come back up this way. That curve looks easier. Ah. Uh. So this curve looks like might be easier to drag a loaded trailer over, but rewards for hungry workers, yay. Now I can switch to what I should be doing. Bridge on the outskirts. Start tracking. I need two beams. No. I need the stuff on the locked side. The concrete slab. I've got the brick, I've got the metals, the metal beams, and I've got another vehicle taking care of the consumables. All I need from here is two concrete slab. <clears throat> and whether they're still locked in the game or not, it should let me load them. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yes, and every trailer I previously s discovered is going to be new trailer discovered. <sighs> every vehicle I previously discovered, I'm going to end up discovering over again. Where does that road go? I see a track going that way, but it just ends in those rocks. Are they saying if you climb over those rocks, you can go right out? I don't know. Two concrete slabs. Let me double check. It did say slabs, right? I looked at it just a minute ago, but that doesn't mean shit. Yeah, 
It's not on my screen. There we go. <clears throat> See, now this is where I said going up the other side might be an easier way out. Because I, I've tried this one before and I know it sucks shit. I usually end up rolling the truck. Hey, I got up it. Unfortunately, I'm pointing the wrong direction, but No, that's just never going to work. Maybe I can do this one. Like I said, the other one's easier to get up. You're better off just to use that one going in and back out. See, because now I'm going to get stuck here. Yeah. I'm going to have to go the other way. I might have to go all the way around. Would you fucking go forward already? I never wanted it to roll back that far in the first place. Oh, there we go. See, what did I say? It's easier to go out the other way. What I've done in the past is climbed the little hill there. And then I'm going the right way. They put a lot more rocks across here so you can't climb the hills. Well, not as much. This is where I came in. And as I just go boony bashing through the trees, I need to make a left at the top. Yeah.
Although well, considering my time constraint, booning bashing through the trees doesn't sound too bad. I don't know what that arrow over there is for. Oh, it's because there's, um, there's something this job needs on that trailer. But I don't personally don't give a shit. <laughs> because I've already got it. There's um, a couple vehicles out here in the swamp. Um, there's the Don. And is that the Azov over there? Looks like it. There's a Dawn and an Azov both out there, and we have jobs for both of them. And I actually did both of them back in the Russian server days, or the Russian version days. And in the past, I had this road open, and now it's blocked again. Hmm, that's new. Lots of new shit. Including new thicker mud that's even harder to drive through I mean I complained about that the last time I was doing the village about how thick the mud is that pipeline is new um, well the yellow black stripes on it are new oh I see what he did See, I used to go, I used to just turn left and go up to the other road right here. He put a river there through there, so you can't. But he gave you bypasses on this side. See, I used just turn left and I was up there. Now there's river and stones and he moved the uh, he moved the big collision further south or the big collapse I meant to say. And he, or he moved the other bridge north when he was putting the river in. I noticed on the map that you have a choice here. You can slog through the swamp or you can try to go over the top of all these rocks. The rocks are the shorter path
but this is a, a trail I have not taken. Because like I say, I used to just turn left. Right before you got to collapse on the road, <clears throat> you turn left, you go up a little hillside, and you come out on the road above that where you need to fix the other bridge. And you just keep on rolling. He took out that shortcut. I want to make sure. Yeah. Well, this crickety creaky bridge really isn't the one that I wanted to go across on. There's a really good bridge further to the east. But it's also a longer drive. I feel pretty good about the M747 not getting the Whoa! What was I just saying? It's these new handrails. What they did... They put on all the little wooden bridges... Well, not all of them. On some of the little wooden bridges like that. Especially the ones that are more... More screwed up like that one. They put wooden handrails on the bridges and those wooden handrails act just like um, a guardrail or a power pole or or anything else as far as um, I didn't really need to come in here. I just needed to go through and back out the other side and then turn north because you can only fix the bridge from one side. I came in here last time to add a... Um, to add a consumable. What did I do? I... Is this where the fucking thing is? Yes. What did I do? I... I dropped off the... concrete... to open this factory. And then I grabbed a consumable... to do the other job. the job we're on now. So I probably could have cut cross country instead of going that far north. In fact, now that I mention it, now that I did it, that way and realize that I could have just cut cross country. I was thinking about that before I started the video.
I don't want to go way the hell out there. That looks like something you might be hard to get across. Oh, shit. I need to go out here and up like this and over. I'm already 31 minutes in. Shouldn't take as long to get here with the other truck. Because I don't have to go through the quarry first. God's tempting to just turn left. I need to go straight north. Oh, some more scenery, new scenery. You know, I don't think this is the um, the way around the the one that goes all the way around. I think this is some shortcut up through that village. But I needed to turn left, so I turned left. Ah, a job. And a truck, which I'll have to worry about with a scout vehicle. I'm cutting this right down to the wire. Now I'm taking damage. Oh. All good. I gotta look and see where I am. I'm sure I'm heading north. Now this is the long way around. I think I've already got hired worker in my list. Well, who knows if any of those jobs that I previously activated will still be good. I might have to restart them. Well, this used to be a pretty good road. That's why I didn't recognize it. little bit of hiccups. Now, yep, this is where I turn left to go to the bridge. That's what I thought. Even though the road doesn't even look the same. It was a pretty good road before. 
Oh, this is pretty good here. Now I just need to park off to the side somewhere and get the other truck up here. I don't want this thing to be in the way of the other one. No, don't do that. You know what, there's a road coming in right over there. No steep bank to mess with. into town over here and jump in this IX3880. And get it out from under that damn thing so I can change the camera angle. Now this has two metal and a brick. As you saw, the job needs two metal, two concrete slab, a brick, and a consumable. So right now you're probably thinking, well, where's the consumable? We're on our way to go get it. But I'm trying to see something here and that damn thing. Ah, never mind. Looks like there's a trail going off to the left there. It's just like some... Something misleading. I don't think I should try to go over that. This mud is frickin' terrible, man. I was hoping the truck would handle it better than the scout did. It quits right there, so I'm going to stay up here. Take the long way around. Uh, but then I got more of it right here. Actually, um, no. Do have to stay to the left. Oh man. I told you he made the mud even more difficult.
Tim's winchin might go faster. It'll never grab something out in front of you, though. It always grabs something uh, beside you. What? Oh, I think it was the anchor on the crane versus tree root in the mud. That winch point isn't helping anymore. I still like the map, but dang. How much time are you supposed to expend on doing these jobs when when you sit spinning your mud spinning your tires in a mud puddle for 10 minutes This is a long one, admittedly. I'm going from one furthest corner of the map all the way to the other furthest corner. And then from the middle of the map to the furthest corner, so we're making the trip twice. I don't know what job that is. I think it's a job I did already. That's new. Another ship. No, I think that's where we... No, that was there before. They just redid the ship. It wasn't so prominent from this angle. Come on, spin. I want to bring in that scout vehicle with its one consumable behind me.
And there is a fuel station coming up ahead. There's fuel in right there too. That area around the fuel station, they've changed that. That used to be a huge body of water. And I used to be able to get across this as long as I stayed close to the fuel tanker. If you get on the other side of that mud bank there, it'll take you down river. Or at least it's more likely to. This is taking way too long. doesn't help that they keep, you know, changing the map. That's container terminal. Fuel's up here. See, it was set back. It was set further back off the road. The container terminal before. This doesn't really need fuel, but that, um, can I? No, I can't fuel them. I need to fuel up the, god dang. I need to fuel up the pickup behind me, or it won't make it over and back. Oh shit. The K-30 is sitting back there in the muddy swamp. Because I had to winch the truck through it, that released the winch on the scout. Son of a bitch. Ah, uh, where is it? Way back here. Yeah. That ain't going anywhere by itself. At least it wasn't out in the middle of the river getting washed downstream. the heavy trailer pull us across.
I get another one. Oh, nope, it's still on the trailer. Well, it's on the back of the trailer now, well side, but I'll take anything I can get. If I stop and do it manually, I can probably get it up to that pole over there now. Yeah, good. I mean, 34 liters of fuel left. I gotta get up there. And 52 minutes on the clock. <sighs> oh, won't take long now. We'll fuel it and get it hooked back up again. And then we'll start the journey over there. I'm just... I just wonder about what other obstacles they put in the way. What other new obstacles they put in the way. I know about this. It's rough, but you can get across it. And then everything's there. So we're really not that far away. If you could just get on the throttle and haul ass. Yes, it is running. Half the suspension's gone. Actually, I could fix that. I think that's right side to right side. functions open anyways. Now this... Oh! That's a new branch going over to another tunnel. Uh, room for expansion would be my guess. Now did the Consumable make it across the bridge. It would appear so. Am I pulling the Truck okay, yep. It's not running off to one side or the other. Right over the, I believe right over the top of this hill is that rough bridge. Yep. 
they surprise you with it. Well, the trailer slid off, but the wood is still on it. Hopefully no more surprises. Well, unless you count a rock in the middle of the road as a surprise. That was never there before. Neither was this thing on the right. The spilled tractor and trailer. Or all the mud. This was a good road all the way across. Mm, need a drink. Now, if my memory is correct, I did the other part of this job previously. It was just this part that I had not gotten to yet. We will unload to metal beam. After I unpack the shit, close. Unpack. Cargo management. No, I need it packed. But I was trying to unload it with it packed and it said it didn't like it. So then I thought unpack it. There we go. See that was um, that was loading it prior to the map update. Unloading it after. If I wiggle this around a little bit, I can get the consumables up here. But not like that. That's totally not what I wanted to do. That is what I wanted to do. I gotta let it roll back so it's not actually in the cargo unloading zone. Then I can change truck and get the consumables up here. Boy, I really left it sticking out, didn't I? That's not what I want. I mean, obviously, that's not what I wanted to do.
See, it's not saying that I have... There we go. Awesome. I can kind of close this. Back it up. And just pull it off into the woods over here. Something like that. Set the brake, shut off the engine. And go back to this one. It shouldn't matter if I do the brick before the other stuff. It is listed first, but who cares? What am I supposed to do? Jeez. Too many things going on at once. cargo to load. I'm not trying to load cargo. It says bricks one available. There it went. It was my mouse bug. Because I opened it with the mouse, it wasn't letting me get rid of it. with the controller. I think I'm going to try to just leave this here. And bring the grass up. Hopefully it won't matter that there's another truck in there. quite the scene, all three trucks to get one job done. Eh. See, it's not letting me Not letting me grab the concrete slabs. Escape. Let's try it again. Told you it's buggy.
I can turn it around and back out. Ah, close enough. And good enough for what we needed to do today. We have a bridge to drive across. Look at that. And there's another gas station on the other side. And you get vehicle spare parts, consumables, and fuel here. And I think this is a container factory, but I wouldn't swear to it. Um, I'd, uh, I've got a scout truck up here now, though. I can run down there. Open that up. So, at any rate, I'm at an hour eight. So, not too bad. Thanks for watching. See you next time.